Hello, this is Roy Holmes with Exos API and this is the SCGA Fit Tip. Today we're going to talk about a, a key ingredient to improving your golf game, improving your drive, improving your overall health is essentially something that all golfers and all athletes neglect, which is recovery aspect. We're going to utilize two pieces of equipment today. We're going to utilize our massage bar and then we're going to utilize our AccuStrap. First thing what we want to do utilizing our massage bar is that we're trying to find trigger points throughout our body or we're trying to find anything that's a little bit tender. So either from our round earlier in that day or just from the, the daily grind. What you're going to do is you're going to take your bar and you're going to massage out any area that's basically, you know, just muscle tissue. So as you're going through, if you find something that's a little bit tight, essentially what that's called is a trigger point. So a trigger point, if most of you guys don't know, it's like trying to stretch out a knot. So if I take this and I have a knot and I keep pulling on that, essentially that knot is just going to get tighter. So what we want to do is we want to get that knot to relax so now I can really elongate the muscle quality. With our massage bar, we're going to essentially go through about 10, 15, 20 times, or you can do it, you can do it by time. So you can say about 30 seconds, one minute each area. So you're going to hit your calf, you're going to hit your hamstring, and you're going to hit your quad. Once your muscle tissue is nice and relaxed, then this is now when we want to involve our AccuStrap. So getting that nice and long, we're going to tie this around one of our feet. And then what we're going to do is we're going to lay down on our back. We're going to perform three different stretches here. So the first stretch is going to be a hamstring stretch. So laying down on your back, a couple of key things you want to look at is that we want to keep the foot wrapped and actually have your toes pulled down towards your face. We want the opposite leg to be as straight as we possibly can and then essentially have that toe point straight in the air. What you're going to do is you're going to hold for about 20 seconds, 30 seconds to get that hamstring to relax. It's just pulling that foot towards your face. From there, lower the leg back down, and now you're going to pull your leg out to the side, essentially stretching out your adductor, opening up your hip. From there, we're then going to pull our leg to our opposite shoulder, again, maintaining our toe position pointed straight in the air and keeping our shoulders flat, and then also holding that for about 20 to 30 seconds. This is something that should be a part of our daily routine. This is something that you can do every single morning. If you want to add that additional drive or if you want to add just a little bit more or improve your career longevity of actually keep playing golf, then this is something that I would, I would guarantee you need to add to your game. Thanks for joining us today. See you next time for another SCGA Fit Tip.